Howdy folks, welcome to episode three. Today we're going to go ahead and buy our train and stuff like that. The sun is just coming up. I think we missed the I think we missed the Auroras this time. But anyway, yeah, um let's go like this and we're gonna see if we can buy the trains that we wanted. We we're gonna buy this one because and I think we had number five? Yeah, and then we had the headlight. Let's let's check out the headlight again. Can we walk? Yeah, we can walk around in here. Interesting. I wonder if we can... <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't remember which one. I kind of like that. That looks cool. I like the little thingy on it. And then... Let's see which paint job we liked. I think it was a gray, gray looking. Let me see. There, number three... Oh, there was one that, yeah, there we go. The one that looks super old. That's the one. Okay. That's cool. And then, uh, yeah, we'll do we'll do a simpler smokestack because we're going to make it look old. All right. And then we're going to order that. Oh, we're going to call it, what were we going to call it? <laughs> I know we had a name, Old Mo, right? Oh, we're going to do number one, and then we're going to call it Old Mo. And then we're going to do a go like this. Whoops. There we go. There's why is there no space? There we go. All right. Yeah. When I'd go fishing with my friends, I had one friend who always every giant fish that, or any time they got snagged, <laughs> any time they got snagged on something and their pole was all bent out of shape, they'd pull really hard and their pole was all bent out of the shape, and they're like, "It's old Mo. <laughs> Get the net." <laughs> All right, and we need the ones for the logs, right? Let's see what our... We need the log cars, and so those are going to be way back. They got two of these now. They got mail baggage. Nice, refined gold, the gold ingots. Freight type, none. <laughs> that's, that's terrible. Okay, no freight. Tools and cattle, meat. Let's see what we've got as far as logs. Logs. There we go. Okay. That's the one. We want some of these. Too bad you can't just, like, do, um... Yeah, too bad you can't just do, uh, whatchamacallit. Order a bunch of those. So, let's get five... Let's get six of these. So, we're gonna do this. We're gonna have to move this train out of the way, too, aren't we? Alright. Yeah, we're gonna have to move Betsy out of the way. So, let's go like this. Let's get Betsy out of here and the other cameras backwards all right let's go like this we'll get these a little bit out of the way and then we'll just leave them here that's really loud really loud let me turn that down a little bit <laughs> uh, about a little bit more let's try this there we go. Okay, yeah, because otherwise you're just going to be hearing the sound coming out of my speakers at the same time as the stuff coming out of that game. Okay, so let's go like... I think we're going to put this... Uh, you know what? While we're buying all these cars, that's what we need to do. So we need to get this fueled up and running. So that, uh, yeah, we'll get it nice and heated up. There we go. Okay. And then what we're going to do is we're going to put this... You see, the brakes should be on. Yeah, the brakes are still going to be on. The brakes are on this one. Okay, that's interesting. The brakes are at 98%. So we're going to put this one up here. Let's go like this. Is it going to let me... Oh, you know what? That's right. you got to re-rail using this thing, I think. Let's see if that'll do it. Is it now going to... Yeah, it is. Okay. So let's put that up here. If we can. Is it going to let me? I'm not sure if it's... I'm not sure that it's actually grabbed it. Okay, let's try this again. Rerail. And then that. Okay, now we'll try putting it on this one. I don't know. <laughs> is it not working? 
Oh, that's going to suck. There we go. Okay. Now it finally did it. All right. I was going to say it's going to suck if we uh, can't re-rail stuff. All right. There we go. We got that. And then we're going to re-rail. Whoops. We're going to re-rail this one. I'm curious now if it is going to work the same with the, whatchamacallit. I think it's the demolish rails that's not working if you select it from the other menu. But I don't know about the other one. Okay. So we're going to get that warmed up. We're going to get these other cars purchased so that we can put them all together. So let's get, I really wish it would save your spot on the cars. And then we're going to do, I'm not going to, I'm not going to put numbers and stuff on them right now. Um, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Okay. So it's 12 clicks. Let's just do this. Uh, there. I missed. <laughs> There's number four. Do we got it? Okay, and then we're going to do a couple more. There. And then last one. We'll get on here. There we go. Okay. Yeah, because with these, it's like, I don't know, the numbers don't do anything for me. So we're going to try re-railing with this. Yeah, okay, it does work. All right, we're going to re-rail this to here. There we go. And then we're going to re-rail this one to here. As close as we can get it. There we go. And then we're going to re-rail these, if it'll let me. I'm hoping to get all of these in one row so that, let me see, is that switch, that switch is going the wrong way. Okay, we're going to do that and hopefully that'll, <laughs> yeah, it's not going to, it's not going to do it, is it? Rerail, try this again. There we go, okay. And then we got to get these two little ones down here too. There we go. Rerail flat car. All right. Whoops. Not up. Not back there. Up here. Up here. There we go. Okay. And then these two little trailers on here. Let's rerail these. We need to find a place to put Betsy too. We need a place to park Betsy so that we can uh, figure out where. To oh, you know what? I know where we can park Betsy. We can put it on the third rail up there okay we can put Betsy on this one for now okay so we're gonna go like this re-rail Betsy up here okay all right so that's interesting the <laughs> the rope doesn't re-rail <laughs> all right so let's get we're gonna put the brakes on this last one and then everybody else is going to have the brakes off. And we should probably, you know, I think we got enough space there. Okay. And actually, we're going to do this because we don't want to over roll the end. Yeah, let's actually, there's no reason to not do this. So let's go put some more track on here. We're just going to go like this. Run it way out there just in case we run over the, past the end. Okay, so we're gonna turn off all the brakes on these and we'll get everybody set up. Oh, you know what we also need to do is we need to put the, the clippies in. But let's get all the brakes turned off and then we can go back and get all the clippies. And we're gonna put it on the front car of everything. So we'll put, get, this there we go all right and then the brakes turn the brakes off all right so we're gonna put clippy can I not where am I <laughs> all right we're gonna put on the on the front yeah yeah so let's take that out we're gonna put it on the front of every car is that right no you know what let's do that the other way because that way we can stand on the car that's gonna be hit 
You know what I mean? So we're going to put it on like this. That way we're standing on the car that gets hit and we can just aim at the thing and we can be standing there and it'll 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 stay relative to our position. So we don't have to try to re-aim right as it hits to put the spike in. Okay. And then this last one. All right, so we just need to, this should be warmed up now. And then, yeah, we are gonna need to take that back past the switch too, aren't we? We're gonna have to be, a, yeah, we're gonna have to take that whole train back past the switch. Let's go like this too, because I need to do this. All right. Because I'm going to take this, I'm going to do it off camera, but I'm going to take this whole thing back up and load it up with logs. So we'll do that. I don't want to spend more time on this episode doing that. But we're going to go reverse. And we want our generator. Oh, that's for the lights. Okay. All right, I'm going to turn this up just a little bit. And we'll see if we can get all these things connected. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh, it's going to do this to me, isn't it? I totally screwed this up. But that's fine, too. And it should stop here. And we should stop with everything where we want it to be. Nope, not that one. This one, I just don't want it. I was hoping to get through this so that it doesn't uh, separate again, you know, up here. All right, we did get that one, and let's see if we can get this coupler here. Is it going to let me? I know it's down here somewhere. It's <laughs> Where is it? See, it's not letting me. Let's see if we can find it underneath here. If we can see it there. I think it's being covered by the, the other bounding box, the, the enter vehicle bounding box. Is it? We're going to do all this and then I'm not going to be able to link the, the cars together, right? <laughs> it's terrible. All right, let's see if we can do this. Where is the... See, it's not giving me anywhere to place that. To place the pin. All right, let me figure this out. I will be right back. Aha! Here it is. I had the door open. Apparently the door was in the way. Let's see. Yeah, see, it's right there. Okay, so it's where those little knots are. Huh. Alright. Let's see if we got everything connected, because we should be able to gently move things forward. If, <laughs> if it'll let me get in the... There we go. Let me get in the vehicle. Alright. We should be able to gently drag things forward. Let's go, like, forward... Let's see, because we just need to get these two past the switch. And then I can take them back to the other thingy. Yeah, it looks like we're good. Okay. All right, cool. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring these over, fill them up with logs, and then we'll go deliver the logs. So I will be back in just a minute. All right, we are back, and we got a full load of got a full load of uh, logs here, and let's get this show on the road. We're gonna go up to the uh, which we call it, and we'll see if we can the up to the sawmill, and we'll see if we can get our stuff delivered. Um, let me see. 
I'm, I was just thinking, you know, we should probably buy the other cars and put them on there, but I think we'll, we'll do this first. And then we'll get the other cars and we'll bring the whole kit and caboodle next time. But I just wanted to get some delivering done here. And get some driving done here. Let's see if we can get up this hill. I think this is going to be like a 3% slope here for a bit. I don't know. Let's see. The other one was a mild uphill, and so it was messing me up thinking that my top speed was only 24, but that was on a slope. And I think this is level ground. But yeah, we'll see if we can get this to... See? I think it's... Yeah. I think we'll hit about 28, maybe? Let's see if we can hit 28. <laughs> well, at least the reverser does what it's supposed to do. It's kind of funny because I just got a, a car that my old car broke down and switched cars. I got a new car. It's not really new. We just we just passed a significant number of miles. Anyway, uh, yeah, it's it does uh, it's a Civic and it does the um, it's got an eco button on it. It says eco or whatever, but it does a uh, it does a thing where it like changes the timing to get more efficient. More efficient. Yeah, I don't think we want to go over 35. I think our limit is going to be 35. So we're going to put the regulator down so we can see what we're doing here. 33. Okay, looks like we're staying about even right there, 15% brakes. Cool. Does it go for, yeah, it does go brighter. Oh, that's cool. The generators dim, generators all the way on. Go back here. That's cool. That's pretty neat. I like it. Looks like we got brights and dims, right? I can't see if there's a big curve coming up, though. It's kind of scary. <laughs> Definitely need longer high beams, right? All right, it's starting to... The slope is mellowing. I don't remember if we have a big curve coming up here. I think we kind of do. I don't remember for sure. I keep looking like these trains are going to be right in the middle of the track. Oh, man. That one was. <laughs> All right, that one was pretty scary. That one went through the. It, it went through the thing. It's a good thing uh, the clipping was off on that. It, it didn't go through the bonding box, but it went through the visible part of the tra <laughs> train. So yeah, that was kind of funny. All right. See if we, yeah, we still got the auroras, the aurora, right? For those of you who took Latin class. <laughs> All right, and then we're going to. Um, which way is our switch here? Let's make sure our switches are going the correct way. Yeah, that is the correct way. Okay, that's right. Turn the brakes back off. There we go. We can even hit the bell here. There we go. So yeah, we'll deliver these. It would be nice if we had a little siding we could put those on, huh? We could put on the, the thingies. The thing is, we have this siding, but we don't have a way out of it. So we'd have to back the cars into there. And we don't have a turnaround, so we definitely need a different way to, to do this. 
think this segment right here needs to be replaced with like a switch. And I'm hoping that this is gonna be long enough. Yeah, we built this pretty long, okay. Let's see, we're gonna zoom in one level. There we go. Just so we can see where the cars are on our map here. Because you know we'd have somebody standing there guiding us instead of the get out and look. <laughs> All right. <laughs> the old get out and look technique. All right. Um. <laughs> Speaking of, I just like totally master parked my bus today too. Backed it up till it within like a foot of the fence on the first shot. That was pretty cool. Alright, is it gonna go? Is it gonna go? Ah, uh, are we gonna get we're gonna get hosed on the logs? Really? Well that's interesting. Did it put them back on the Did it put it back on the thing or did it just bounce high enough that it went back onto it? That's funny. Okay, um it looks like these over here are gonna go onto the yeah, see? Okay. So we can unload them, we just can't unload them way up there. Let's see if this one will work. Yeah, this one will work. Okay, it's just the very front car. Or the front two cars. Alright. We can still unload these. Let's see. That one. Let's try this one. But I think we're going to still need to move. Is it? There we go. It's still not wanting to let me unload it. <laughs> it's just... It's weird. Where's the arrow, right? There we go. Let's try this. Oh, yeah, it's going to unload these two. Yeah, it's just that one. Okay, it's just the one car. We can't get it lined up just perfectly. Okay, so let's... Let's get this one. It's fine. It's close enough, right? That's so weird. Yeah, it's just going to disappear then. Okay. All right, and then we're gonna bring just the three. Okay, I'm just gonna bring those three up. And it, it looks like we've got room. Yeah, we've got room. Okay, so we're gonna go like this. Bring this up. And we'll get these three lined up with the edge here. There we go. All right. Is that pond? Oh, that's kind of interesting. Yeah. Okay. No, I'm thinking. I was thinking that. I was thinking that uh, this right here was was uh, was built to to continue with the lake, but duh, that's just the map. That's just the map. The third party map, not the what the developers used for that. <laughs> Did you see that one bounce? <laughs> nice. Alright. And... How many do we have? Oh, that's right. It's taking some out of there. Because ha I said 18. I'm like, we dropped more than 18. A lot more than 18. Okay. No, it's just making stuff out of it. Okay, let's see if this one will unload. <laughs> Alright. That should give us 26. Yeah, I do. That's right. With the logs, you get five on these and six on these. You might as well just use the the small ones, right? Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put in. We're gonna take out this chunk of track right here for right now. We're gonna demolish. Oh, that's right. This doesn't work, does it? Oh, it does now. Oh man, that's close. <laughs> All right. We're gonna put in a switch right. Wow, that's kind of scary. I'm hoping this doesn't launch it into space. Nope, it's not going to. Awesome. Okay. Then I won't complain. And then I think we can even do this switch left. We're going to do switch left here. There we go. And then these two are going to connect... Um, let me see, with this, I'm not sure if this is tall enough, but we'll see, see if this will connect, 
Yep, that'll connect. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a we're gonna do this. We're gonna put another switch right. Because I want to be able to go back out this way too. We're just gonna make a little tiny siding here. Like that. Just for whatever reason. It's a bypass. You gotta have bypasses. <laughs> okay. Right? Okay, and we'll just make this go perfectly straight out. Oh, that's gonna that's gonna do that. Okay. We're gonna make it go out and then we're gonna use the wall piece to do this. There we go. Alright, cool. And then we'll just have this come out this way. We'll take out a couple of trees. That's fine. A couple two tree. And that is this. This one. Let's see what else we got here. Whoops. Is there something? Oh, there's a little tiny tree. Look at the little baby tree. Okay. <laughs> There we go. All right, that should give us enough room to back this on here. So let's pull these switches if we can. Pull these switches. See if that's going to let me. It's not going to let me, is it? Okay, let's put this switch back because that's going to be a problem if we do that. We're going to move this forward like half a car length. And then we'll uh, then we'll back up. So forward, perfect. Okay. And then we're gonna flip the switches here. Flip both switches, and then we'll put these on the siding for right now. So then we can we can bring them back. We can come pick them up later. All right. Um, because I don't think we're going to be using the... That's the other thing is... The other thing is we're not going to be using these uh, logging cars for quite a while. You know what I mean? We're not going to be going getting more logs anytime soon. So we'll just leave them at right where they are. And... We'll get this out of the fall and then... It looks like that's good. Okay. All right, and then we'll tie these off. We're on level ground, so I think we can just tie the first one off. Take off the coupler. It is on level ground, right? <laughs> yeah, it's not moving. Okay. So let's get this up here, and we're going to go forward. And we'll go back on the track. I guess we'll just go on the main main one instead of going over the little loop. And then we can bring this back to the to the thingy. Back to the uh, depot. Alright, there we go. Okay, so we're gonna head back to the depot. And we'll we'll end up picking up our other things, but I think we're probably gonna I think we're probably gonna be running out of time soon here. Um, let's see here. Let's see what kind of speed we can get out of this. Twenty five, that's it, twenty six. I mean it's not eleven, right? It's not fifteen. <laughs> yeah. Curves are still a little. These curves are still a little kind of scary with these longer, this bigger train. I like the old, the old train, the old paint job and everything. It looks cool. It looks seasoned. It's a veteran train. <laughs> some of these, some of these trees I think need to be clipped over just a little bit for, for visual purposes. We hit those in the bus, I call them window cleaners. Because <laughs> uh, this winter it was going through, uh, we were going through basically this, this a couple of the roads I go down are, are really, really in the middle of nowhere, in the middle of the woods. Oh man, that is so close. 
But yeah, a couple of them are in the middle of the woods, narrow road, and you really don't, it doesn't matter where you go on the road, the trees got covered in snow, and so the branches, instead of being like this, were like that, across the middle of the road, so no matter where you go, you're hitting those window cleaners. Uh, okay, so anyway, yeah, this this is going to be it for episode three. We're already already up to three. So yeah, that's me for episode three. In episode four, we're going to get our um, stuff from the sawmill. I think I'll just get all those cars set up and everything. We'll do a bonus episode or something where I, where I set up the cars so we can actually get the industries open. Um, and we'll get the we'll get the sawmill going. Maybe that's why I'm not going full speed, right? But yeah, we'll get the sawmill finished up. Why is it slowing? Oh, this is the steepest part of the hill. That's why. Okay. But yeah, we'll get the we'll get the sawmill. We'll get the what is it? The mine, the iron mine, I think is next. So we'll get that opened and see if we can get a train out to there by then. But anyway, yeah, that's gonna be it for episode three. Join me in episode four, and we will see you then. Later.